New at 6, a lot of folks complain state lawmakers don't accomplish what they need to, like coming up with a plan to fix our roads. So now the state Senate has voted to shorten the legislative session by a month. Our Capitol reporter Robert Kittle is all over this to tell us why supporters say it would be better for you in this 7 News State House Watch. State lawmakers don't meet on Fridays, so the House and Senate chambers are empty. But they would be empty a lot more under a bill the Senate passed Thursday. It would shorten the legislative session by a month, ending on the first Thursday in May instead of June. I think it's a bad idea. It's sh shortening a session gives people less time to deliberate, gives them less time to decide what they're actually going to do. Uh, I think that they don't need any reason to work less than they already are. Aiken Senator Tom Young is the main sponsor of the bill. He was out of state but told us by phone why he wants lawmakers to spend less time at the state house. The two big things it does is number one, it'll save the taxpayers money, number one. Number two, it'll potentially make it where more people would have the opportunity to uh, offer for public service in the General Assembly. It would save money because lawmakers get a per diem and get reimbursed for mileage. So cutting the session by a month would save taxpayers almost $350,000 a year. A pro would be that we get to save money, but I think a con would be that there's so many things to discuss and they only have a short amount of time and to cut it even more would probably wouldn't benefit anybody. Senator Young says it would force lawmakers to be more efficient. Supporters say lawmakers already shorten their sessions just about every year. The House has been off this past week and the week before on furlough to save money. The Senate also took a furlough week off. Senator Young says that shows they could meet less since they already are. In Columbia, Robert Kittle, 7 News. The Senate passed that bill yesterday on second reading. That means it needs one more vote next week. If it gets that, it goes to the House, which has passed bills to shorten the session 10 times before.